Welcome to the Rome campaign for Davidi X Imperial 1.2.4 and we are picking up where I left off in the previous video. The only difference is that this army came down and took out a rebellion or what was left of a rebellion down here and what I want to do in this part is push out against the Vertones. Looks like these guys are recruiting so what we probably need to do is get in and attack them first. I'm also a little bit worried about the Lusitani. They seem to be creeping up this way. So, well, we might as well get to it. Actually, can I? Let me do a bit of army sabotage here. No, agent failed. Isn't that a surprise? Your concealed agent has been found by foreign forces as well. That's not going to be a problem. We're going to get in here. Right, they've got quite a lot of cav but it looks like we could, they must have been recruiting two units and of course we're gonna have to fight this okay here we are start uh, nice and dry start deployment And they are going to be very much up there. Means their cavalry is probably going to try and come around the flank. I'm inclined to bring this guys this way. We have the usual formation. We have the missile troops there. We're going to keep them in fairly tight. And I have the general there, usual formations over here. And we have these units here to defend on this flank. And your job is going to be to hold this flank. Actually, um, I think we're going to close the line up a little bit and have a reserve this time so we're going to keep have this very heavy infantry in the back like that um, what we're going to do is start moving the leaders forward you guys just keep in I mean, there's a good chance they're going to try and run for those hills. Now, the main concern is their cavalry because they've got medium. Oh, they've only got medium melee cavalry this time, not heavy cavalry. It was the heavy cavalry that actually did the damage last time. Get these guys on skirmish. General. Yeah, they're up this hill, which is, could be a bit of a problem. Just let the guys, let them move into position. The legions march. And we don't get a chance to look at these legions very much, actually. Uh, yeah, they look pretty cool, actually. That's my heavy legion. Oh, these guys mean business, don't they? I'll just speed up a little bit, actually. Mm. What we're going to do is just move forward a little bit more. Keep the missile troops close behind. They're quite wisely holding their calf units up. The real threat could come from these calf units, so we're going to have to these guys tight. Okay. And yeah, they've got the range on us, so we're just going to keep squeezing in. Here they come. Romans ready for duty. Brave Romans to a man. Orders, my lord. At the ready. 
you guys. Oh, my cab got left behind. Archers in. Units has used all its ammunition. Shoot guys out. Right, you guys start to move forward. Keep the archers tight. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Let's push these legions onto these. We keep you guys protect the flanks. You've got the cav now in your sights. You guys. One of our units has used all its ammunition. You guys come into here, right? Time for the Proud Romans all. Right, somehow these guys have got in amongst these. You keep hitting their cab on this side. I've lost the cab on this side. Right, time for you guys to start sweeping the back. So general. Okay, all away. Right, these guys are breaking. Cavalry got him behind. Cav that way. General this way. Right, get in to support these guys. Let you destroy those. Guys, come in here. Um, you guys, come into this section. You guys, here, keep hitting that cav. Archers fire into there. Oh, you guys, just keep pushing on those. Guys, come into there. I'll just keep. Right, you guys are killing those off. We await your orders. Battle ready. Find your target. These guys are breaking. Skatari. These guys are broken. Skatari, you fall onto those archers. General, you guys 
go into there and we'll provide support. Right, we're losing our archers on this side, which is a little bit annoying. Anchors crumbled on this side, but now got this cavalry. Just the general. You guys start to fall onto these. You start to chase that. Let's sort this mess out. Cavalry in. Taking a lot more damage than I was hoping I would take. So I would like to use this army to take the. Get these guys back in. The enemy general is dead. Enemy general is dead. General in continue. I want this army pretty badly wrecked. Um, okay, we're just going to speed up a little bit. You kill those, uh, you kill those got here you drop onto these hey cut it out yeah we had a couple of units I think because I just let that the right flank just collapse a little bit I put too much focus on the left bank flank what we got here we've got some men here that need to die I think that would be about it. It's going to quick battle, end battle. So we lost 501, which is a few more than I was hoping I would. I mean, General did well, the Cav did well. Yep. Down goes the army. Um. Mm, I'm going to take the cash, to be honest. It's not going to be able to get in. Great, that means I'm going to have to pull this army across. I'm a bit worried about these Yozos. Um, I, I need to knock these guys out this turn. Or do I? I'm just so worried about these guys. Um, they don't actually have an army and they won't be able to recover. How big is the garrison here? 16. Commander. These guys should be able to take down a garrison of 16. Yeah, I think I just don't like these troops hanging around over here. We're going to send this army back this way. And we're going to bring this army back this way. Back into friendly territory. And you get a first cohort and pump out a nice big forge of these guys. And okay, you can't move because I used to use the action. You're okay. We've got 19,000 to spend on that force there. Ready for orders. Yeah, damaged. You can't we refurbish just yet. And let's have a quick look through and see what we got. We've got here fishing. Yep, in the mid air. You're looking good. It's going to consume food. We're a bit low on food, so we're going to have to be a bit careful. I mean, I'm guessing that the. What we got here? 
party loyalty. Use this for. And can I take off some other quick recruiter? Not diplomatic. Uh, where is it? It's called affiliations. This is the plebeians, and I think the plebeians have got the, the lowest standing of all. And they're only 28. We really need to get some of these guys in. Um, I could. No, I don't think it's going to be worth the effort, to be honest. What are they doing? Latin culture. You've got 38 against 6 against 2, so there's no point pushing up the Latin culture. Uh, you're okay. You're still building Terrakinesis. Sequestium. Manufacturing industry. You're 14. That would take it up. I mean, if plus 25% from all industries. Or. Um, yeah, I, I like that. Well. Um, yeah, I think we're going to go with that there. I think. No, we're still low on food. Uh, and the public order here isn't brilliant. I'd like to push the public. There's the squalor here. The squalor's good. I think we're going to push the food situation there. And Mauritania. Actually, let's go back to. Let's punch that for the Empire maintenance. And I think we're just going to hang on to the rest of the cash, guys. I'm just going to go for an end turn. Okay, we've got some traditions and we've got a promotion. Okay. Oh, we got promotion on both counts. Okay. He's got some military stuff, so let's just get in a bit of economic help. And we certainly want campaign movement range. Um, plus 25% morale for attritional losses. I'm not ready yet to start using the upkeep costs, so we'll, we'll stay with that. And I'm just going to go for an end turn. Okay, got an increase in rank. Uh, general rank 7, wow. Returned home. Returned home for military command. I was engaged in faction politics. This, I'm not sure who that actually is. Okay. I think that's the guy I sent back. I can't remember who he is. New political election. The man has been elected to pivotal point in his career. There's new predator for this year. New political election. Okay. Mission failed. Senate. Yeah, well, I'm not interested in that. Object gain is notoriety. Okay, let's just do this bit. Um, why do not characters? Ah, sorry, brain faded a little bit. Well, General was seeking permission to sell down the... Okay, we're allowing. Uh, he wants to do that. Let's overfloats his boat. Now, which general came back? It was the general that took some damage. I can't honestly remember who it was. Wow. What are you doing in Latin? You're a member of the junior family. What are you doing in Latin? What we got here? Ready for battle. Yeah. Let's see if I can find any. At your command. You're a one star general. My instinct is to replace this guy with. Uh, who's the. Right, this. Wow. So many of these guys. Right, this is. Um, I think we're going to hire 
yeah, you're the guy who took the damage. That should increase my income, and he can sit over here in the relative safety of this area. And get you out of patrol. But I feel the need to reshape this army a little bit. I mean, we've got loads and loads of missile troops, far more missile troops than I actually need. Yeah, these guys are not much good, so we're going to get rid of these. And we're going to get a first cohort in here. I'm just going to reshape this army as a defensive force. I think the other thing that I noticed here is that one of these armies has got um, mercenary infantry. This army needs to be reshaped a little bit as well. We hunger for battle. Yeah, you're in good condition. And can you actually? Can you get on the border? I want this army just to get a bit of experience. Um, so that's. Um, they got one general and all that, and of course we're gonna have to fight this. So. Right, they've come out on the battlefield. We've got cav superiority, which is great, and it looks like we've got missile superiority as well. Although they've got some, it looks like they've got some axemen, which could be fun. But so I just want the second army to get in, get a bit of experience. And hopefully that way we'll protect, be able to protect some of these damaged units so that they can have a chance to do it. Wow. Right, they're coming in from there. Let's... Mm. What we're going to do is form the front line this army and then Brave Romans to a man. Infantry. they've got no cav but we're gonna have these guys as a reserve I'm pretty sure the incoming army has a some what we call it some cavalry Sorry, brain faded a little bit there, guys. I think if we keep the, these guys together as units like that, just bring you over this way. You guys just split out like that. And you can just sit on this side in that position so that we'll see what comes in. So I'm just going to come in here. Now, I'm not going to rush into this because... I want my reinforcements to come in and join the battle. So we're just gonna. Our yeah. reinforcements have arrived. Yeah, that's it. Get the heavy mob in. I think what we will do is move all these archers over this way. Bring in these guys on this flank here. We can bring over. Uh, we've got all four archers on this side. Working with these. I think we're. Bring a couple of you over. So we can redo the front line here. And then. General. So this army didn't have any cav. Well, that's annoying. This army definitely needs to rebuild. We're just going to speed up a bit, guys. And I think that's... Just you start to move forward. Get these 
these troops into position. There they are. We're up in this corner. I think we don't need these troops in the battle at all. Just get the I think I can actually form a solid front line now. And General, you guys drop right back. Missile troops can be replaced, so. Oh, not quite that easily. That means there's probably some troops in this area here. You guys come up to here. Okay, they're coming in. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Archers, you go behind. You get ready with that flank. You pull off that flank. Actually, I think we're going to push you across the back like that. What we're going to do is in these. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Sorry. Right, Cav. Break behind. Is coming to there. One of our units has used all its ammunition. You guys start to push forward. And we'll round that back. The men are wavering. Hey, idiots. You were meant to stay behind the line, out the way. He didn't last long. It's very messy, very messy. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Uh, Cav in. You guys come into there. Let's fire over the back like that. One of our units has used all its ammunition. You think you could get in the action, General? Right, you guys have done your job. You get away. I don't want you. General, just squeeze in this way. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Uh. Get away. Ah, they've broken. There's the light cav. Generals, you, you team up for a double whammy. Actually, you go 
let's break this way. Double general charge. That's interesting. Both generals in. Right, we've lost the momentum. Now we'll drop the legionaries in. You guys form up again. We'll put a double charge onto these. You over there. You guys squeeze in on those. Generals working together. Right, in they come. is their general unit. Right. Crush in on these. They've gone in battle. Lost 334. Yeah. I suppose for a second attack these units had to take some damage because they took the main attack. So this army is going to have to rest and refurbish. And that should be the end of the Atones. And occupy. Health experience. Not there. Yep, they're gone. Now what I want to do is dispatch this my agents. Got one here. I think we're going to want you over this way. You can see these guys. This army is definitely going to have to um, just check this army over here. Late Libyan infantry. 8-9. Armour 68. My instinct is to maybe merge these armies up and make this into the Legion and then this army can fall back in this direction to do with any rebellions which will then free this army up to get back into the front line but we'll have to do that in the next part because so I better do the business here. Uh, can't do a tier 3 so I'll have to take that down. Then you're going to take that down because we're going to want food. What we got here? If it's 15, that's 14. That's 14. That's growth. We don't really need growth. Three growth. Two public order, one growth. Yeah, I, I think we will go with that. I mean, this. Does this actually have any. No. I mean, the special attribute was there. As far as I can see, this doesn't have any special attribute. Now we're going to have to try and make everybody happy because at the moment we're steadfast. But that's not good enough if we're going to carry on our war. Let's check the political situation. At the moment these guys, we still have access. My instinct is probably to take down the Lusitani next and then squeeze back onto those because we might be able to go the Lusitani into attacking us, but at the same time, can I be cheeky? Yes. Uh, do, 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 do. This, I need to get some more experience for my... Yeah, you've just got a job. 
you go try and soften up the Satani. Yeah, up to full strength. You're not married. We need to get you married. You're married. Uh, you're full up. You're full up. Yeah, you're married. You're married. So these are all up to strength in the, this family. Yeah, you you two need a little bit of experience. So I think we'll send you to Athens. And why are you not married? That's annoying because I suppose. influential woman trouble is I don't really want another general in here because we've got one two th one two three four five already actually we can afford to take the chance of getting her killed so we could send her to the Averni and send you to someone who's a bit more friendly Egypt Helveti I don't know you can go to Helveti We'll just take a chance on any of those getting killed. Wow, we've got negative three food. Okay, what we're gonna have to do is yeah, we got minus twenty-two food, so we're gonna have to just have to knock out the income from there. Wow. That was big. That's probably because I've got all these armies in this area. Alright, we've got this general here. Authority or land units, four percent. Yeah. Actually, quite like that because he's uh, one of my generals, and you've got lots of morale. Actually, quite like that as well. That gives me that. Yeah, I think if we pop that in like that with the extra morale, that makes this army. A bit more dead thing. I'm sure one of these armies had some uh, javelin tr troops in. I can't remember which one it is. Is it this one up here? If it is, it's going to be annoying because levy slingers. Maybe an infantry. Iberian mercenary infantry. Hmm. I think maybe it's time to upgrade this army. Get these guys in here. Got Marion Legionary Cavalry. I mean, it's going to cost me money, but I just feel I need to. Actually, you're 814. That just makes this army more stronger. I think I've got enough time for one more turn, guys. So, because I'd like to see the results of all that diplomatic activity, get this area built up, move this, let's do the swap while I remember it. We're just going to go one more end turn. Okay, we've got some more uh, promotions. Ready for okay. battle. How come? Okay. Well, you certainly need to be a knight commander. Yeah. So this guy's now got some. Uh, I think he's a plebeian, so he, he'll get a bit more experience, wealth and authority. Now you're not going to be wandering around that far, so then again, let's just have a see what we got on the ground. I don't want to give him that. Armour for all units, next local province. I actually quite like that, and yeah, we're going to give him that. And Okay, oh, you've got promotion as well, have you? Okay. Wow. We've got loads of cash flowing in at the moment. We'll give you a cavalry promotion. Uh, Naples war cry, yeah. Because eventually you're going to be in the thick of it. Back in those, so here we go. We'll go for the end turn. Okay. Got someone ready to command. New political intrigue, consequence, your diplomat has been trade, troop morale penalty, thank you. 
Or we'll return with a generous tribute. 52,000. <laughs> well, Dittman's returned accompanied by a clever tactician. Your armies will march further for a while. One, the cavalry recruits will be better trained. Okay. Return home. Okay, child is born, child is born. Mission successful. You have subjugated 13 different factions by making your, them, uh, your clients sell, capture them last remaining settlement. So we've got another 17,000. Wow. New objective issued. Completely control 10 provinces either by direct ownership or through client states. And that would make 18,000. Yeah, filthy spectacle with influence minus 10. So that should. That should. Let's just have a look at the balance of power. So we're still looking pretty good here. Authority for more, more political parties. Famous scholar. Uh, respecting the Senate. Okay, we're looking good. Now, my agent over here is still wandering around trying to find the Seleucids. Mm, what I'm thinking is to send them this way. This is Bactria. There we are, there's the Seleucid Empire just down here. You, want, you just keep trolling through here like that. Looks like Bactria's come here. There's a lot of very powerful factions here. Life is going to get very interesting. Anyway, let's do the one thing that I wanted to do, which is we're going to pull this army back out here. Your next command. Um, what we're going to do is you go to here. And what I'm thinking is we're going to pull these back, give this army these, and pull these back give the army these and that's going to be enough okay we're going to pull you out these are legionaries that's a veteran legionary this army's got no cav and i think we're going to go with that Make haste, men. hey what are you doing over there and then March. is that because you were close to the city your next command. And what that means, this army At your command. will be full strength. It's got cav. Is, and I want to use these guys working with an archer. So what I'm thinking is to have one of these and an archer on each flank to try and hold back the cav. I'm a little bit worried about these guys. So Ready for battle. we're going to just bring this up, army up here. Destination reached. Commander. And what we're going to do got a temple going there and certainly want that in there got a quarry which probably won't turn into much I mean we got just put the food back on minus 18 my instinct is to double down with the food we I can't see the point in putting in a recruitment capability here because we can recruit here and because this is all part of the same province yeah i think for the moment we're going to double down with the food until the food situation improves actually can we topic order that's going to consume food that's going to consume food yeah we're going to double down with the food at the moment May maybe make this more into an agricultural someone because this doesn't have that much I think that will work we got 49,000 to spend wow. hmm. I think while I've got the money Ready for battle. Uh, let's just keep those and uh, take you off Commander. Um, here I think we're going to give you Gonna give you a Marion first cohort and Rome needs good fighters. just build this army up. I mean, we got somewhere in 16,000. We hunger for battle. And that's time for you to go and uh, give them this. We've got one, two, three, two, three, four. You can go. We don't need five sets of archers. Well, we don't actually need 
that number of archers. So we'll drop this down to two of these and three archers. And I'm just going to get a couple of Marion. Actually, cancel that. And we'll get some Libyan cavalry in here. Give more of a cavalry front to this army. Um, let's retrain him. What are you retrained to? General of the Legion. I don't know if they're actually. But he's. I mean, he's a big general, so why shouldn't he be a general of the Legion? He should be entitled to that rank. We've got this army here. Just waiting. Euro. And this army is a little bit cav heavy for an assault army. But actually, are way too heavy for an assault army. I think we're getting rid of you. I mean, we've got two Tarantines and the Girion. Oh, oh. And get you out of. Ready for orders. And. Barrett Veteran Legionnaires. I think we're Soldiering. it's a good life. Bring this army up to strength. It's this uh, military tribune. Okay. And I'm, I'm just gonna see if we can finish off any of these female characters. You're finished, you're finished, that's good. Uh, any of you guys ready to marry? No. You're finished, you're finished, you're finished, you're finished. Um, the other one is not married, so I think you can go back to the Lusitani for another go. Um, you can, you can go to Athens and you can go to uh, the Adrasi is starting to not like us, so you can go to the Adrasi. The rest of these are to patch. Let's have a quick look at the family. Mm, doo -doo -doo. You're in this really strange family tree here. Where's my heir? The family tree seems to be spreading. But lots of people in here who aren't members of the family. This is turning into a little bit of a hodgepodge. Who's there? You're the family leader. You're a general in Kartuba. Maybe you need to get married. Yeah. Don't really need another. Bah. This family gets much bigger. We won't know what the heck to do. And you're part of. Uh... Yeah, I think we're very good as well. And that gets even more in this family. Let's make sure I haven't messed up the politics. Yep, they're all... Wow, these guys are 93. But you hate barbarians, so... So we're looking good from this perspective. And just to finish off, let's just have a, another run through. You're not ready to go. Tarakinesis, why are you... Oh, you're actually... There's still minus eight food. Mm, you're not really making enough money to justify switching you on. Anonia. And you're over here. That's six food. Nuria. Oh, 
to prove my research rate. And this can increase my empire maintenance. Okay, we're going to pop that. Just to get that going. I know I keep looking at this. Hmm. See that? That still gives me empire maintenance. I think because I've got the cash, I'm going to. Mm, no. My instinct is to go for food. That's going to give me. Yeah, we're going to pop some food there. I sort that level for. Got food coming in there. Hmm. Fishing here. What's this giving me? Public order. I think we're going to knock that down. Get some more food in here. I don't really need this. No, I'd bonus the garrison morale and defense in this region. 5%. Minus 5% My, minus upkeep for all land units local. Yeah, maybe we'll leave that just for the moment. Mm, we got here. Minus 15. I. This is Italia. This is minus four. Minus four food. Squalor. Oh, we've got so much sanitation, we know what to do with. Public order's good here. I think we're go for the back. Just everything really happy. Yeah, you've still got a little bit of an issue. I mean, I'm pushing through a lot of food at the moment, which is a little bit of a cause for concern. You could take that up to a level four. It's going to give me squalor and public order. That will give me an extra three. That's six. I don't think I'm going to push that just yet. And you've got the public order minus 37, so we're going to pop that for some more food. And Emidia, you're okay. Latinum. <laughs> yeah, we may have to start to consider converting one of these to something. Anyway, guys, this is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope you found it interesting. We're probably going to have a period of peace for the moment because what I would like to do is just push the. Uh, Lusitani into attacking us but at the same time I'm just I'm not sure where these guys are going to just have a quick look sorry they're not actually at war with anyone so I'm just a bit worried about whether these guys are going to suddenly think that they can get into a battle anyway this is where i'm gonna leave it hope you enjoyed the episode until next time whatever you do enjoy your gaming